नमस्कार दोस्तों वेलकम टू एस बी आई सिक्योरिटीज मॉर्निंग पॉडकास्ट सो येस्टे वी हैव दी नोवेम्बर सीरीज रोल ओवर सो लेट अस डिस्कस दी रोल ओवर डेटा एंड दी की लेवल्स फॉर दी मार्केट इन ट्रेड टुडे एज वेल एज दी सेक्टर्स दैट वी एक्सपेक्ट टू आउट परफॉर्म एंड अंडर परफॉर्म बेस्ड ऑन दी रोल ओवर डेटा सो फर्स्ट अप सो इफ यू सी निफ्टी फ्यूचर्स हैज ट्रेडेड इन अ थाउजेंड थ्री हंड्रेड एंड एटी एट पॉइंट रेंज Uh, in the first half of the series the index uh, witnessed a sharp correction and marked a low of 23277 level near an important long term support thereafter it witnessed a minor recovery in the expiry week finally the series has settled at 23914 with a cut of 1.20% the rollover for nifty index futures increased significantly to 79.34% compared to last month 72.87% surpassing the 3 month average of 76.99 the number of shares rolled improved to 128 lakhs compared to 115 lakh last month moreover the rollover cost has surged to 0.88% as compared to the 3 month average of 0.52% bank nifty relatively outperformed the frontline indices in the november series It has traded in a wider range of 3,276 points and ended the series at 52,301, uh, with a minor gain of 0.72 percent. The rollover for futures stands at 76.82 percent, higher than the last month's average of 69.36 and above the three-month average of 71.02 percent. Additionally the rollover cost has increased to 0.68 compared to the 3 month average of 0.62 Market wide rollover also witnessed an uptick to 91% compared to 89% last month In the latest series the FI index position uh, reflect a long shot ratio of 32.79 signaling a cautious stance with higher inclination towards short position On the options front for the coming series uh, weekly series notable call open interest is observed in 24000 call followed by 24200 meanwhile on the put side open interest concentration is witnessed in 23800 followed by 23700 strike talking about the crucial levels the 200 day ema zone of 23600 23500 will act as the immediate support for the index Any sustainable move below the levels of 23500 will lead to a further correction in the index up to the levels of 23100 followed by 22700 uh, on the upside if we see the 100 day ema zone of 24400 will act as the immediate hurdle for the index any sustainable move above the levels of 24400 will lead to a pullback rally in the index up to the levels of 24800 25000 levels in the short term india wix a measure of the market volatility has oscillated in the range of 20.75 and 12.73 level going ahead a zone of 16.2 will act as the immediate hurdle for india wix any sustainable move above the levels of 16.2 will lead to a sharp upside rally towards 17.5 followed by 19 in the short term while on the downside the zone of 13.5 will act as the crucial support zone tracking the market breadth so if you see stock uh, single stock futures only 72 stocks comprising 39% of the der- derivative space concluded on a positive note conversely 111 stocks representing 61% uh, closed negatively This suggests that the market experienced an overall bearish sentiment during the November series. In the derivative landscape, only 11 stocks have managed gains surpassing 10%, while 20 stocks have experienced uh, increase uh, range between uh, 5 to 10%. While on the flip side, 15 stocks uh, see declines exceeding 10%, and 31 stocks registered a decrease within the range of 5 to 10%. अगर सीजनैलिटी के बारे में बात करें पिछले 18 सालों में दिसंबर के मंथ में निफ्टी ने 12 बार पॉजिटिव रिटर्न दिया है जिसमें कि एवरेज गेन रहा है 4 परसेंट का वाइल छः ओकेजन्स में नेगेटिव बन दिया है जिसमें एवरेज लॉस हुआ है ऑफ 1.75 पॉइंट सेवन फाइव परसेंट 
the average return for nifty in the december series has been around 2.08% over the past uh, 18 years december has consistently shown an average volatility of 7.42% coming to bank nifty so historically bank nifty has shown a mixed trend in the december month over the past 18 years out of these it has closed positively nine times with an average gain of 5.46% while ended negatively nine times with an average loss of 1.92% the average return for bank nifty in the december series has been 1.77 However, Bank Nifty has demonstrated an average volatility of approximately 10.24% for the past 18 years. Uh, potentially outperforming sectors based on the rollover data, we feel banking, IT, power, uh, finance, reality and PSU banks could relatively outperform during the current series, while potentially underperforming sectors based on rollover data automobile fmcg oil and gas metal healthcare and pharma uh, that's a wrap of today's edition of the podcast thank you for regularly tuning in wishing you all a happy trading session thank you investment in securities market are subject to market risks read all the related documents carefully before investing